Praise the Lord, my dear brothers and sisters. A very big shalom to you in the name of our Lord God and Savior King Jesus Christ. As I mentioned to you, my dear brothers and sisters, that I'm in Punjab, I'd just like to tell you and show you that just behind me, you can see this beautiful place. You know, lots of greenery around there, nice fields. The close by is the church here. And this is a pure village, one of the villages in Punjab, Amritsar. It's a pure village, pure village. And you can see these beautiful village houses that are there, village settlements. And uh, people are very, 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 uh, what do you call that, helpful to one another. They stay in a lot of unity and peace. And uh, that uh, oneness and the fellowship that is there among them is just awesome and so very, very beautiful. And uh, as we are in this mission activity of ours, we found it very easy to communicate with people, to reach out to them, to give the word of God. It's like we had to just tell them one word and then they would do that. Suppose we just told them that we need to clap and dance and pray. They would do it very joyfully. Suppose we had to share a testimony with them. They would really start shedding tears. And if you give them word of God, they took it with faith. And uh, the faith was so strong that they would say like, you know, this has got to happen with us and it should be made complete and possible in our life. My dear brothers uh, and sisters, you know, I just remember the word of God from Psalms 121 verse 8. The Lord says, I will bless your coming in and going out, both now and forever. Well, that is so amazing and I can see it happening in our life. Because uh, I just we just came here two or three days back and uh, we started our mission activities. And in this mission activities of ours, uh, we saw that we were able to reach out to little children, elderly people, uh, people of different types, like different nature, different religion, caste and creed. We were able to meet the Sikhs who become Christians. We were able to meet the uh, local Christians as well. Then we were able to meet, meet people who are of other religion who have now become Christians. But one thing is that the unity among them, they're just one, uh, one with one another. And the church pastors are able to reach out in a much better way. And another thing I'd like to tell you is that uh, it's not that costly like how we have it in our states of Goa or Chennai, Tamil Nadu, Maharashtra and all. It's a little costly, the no doubt standard of living is very high. But here you can get things for a little less array and uh, with a little bit of money you can do a lot of things here. Land is also cheaper, food is really beautifully available, the best of food you can eat here well. Well, coming back to the outreach point of view, we were able to touch the lives of people uh, who were well-to-do, not so well-to-do, people who are not Christians, people who are Christians. We were able to touch the lives of all these people. This was just an update to update you and tell you that our mission activity in Punjab has been to its best and uh, we've really been able to experience the best in union with God. From Punjab here, as I mentioned to you, we're very close to Pakistan here. It's like, it's like, it's just a few kilometers from here and we can get into Pakistan, that's it. Very few kilometers, just a few kilometers. We just, uh, we just need to cross over and that's it, we could be in Pakistan any time. So there is a line of control and all this thing. Let, let's leave that, uh, political parameters, just leave that. What I'm saying is like, from Goa, a mission team has come to Punjab and uh, we are able to do God's will here. So I'd like to pray for you at this very moment. Father God in heaven, I'd like to praise and thank you for all our people watching this program from different corners of the earth, different parts of India, and every person who has been able to share in their joy and happiness with this program of ours, and for everybody who's been supporting us in this mission of ours. Father, we pray for all of them. Father, we pray a blessing, miracle. Pray for the fullness of your word in their life, and let every plan you have in store for them be made complete in their life, according to your riches and glory. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen, amen, and amen. My dear brothers and sisters, when you come out to states like this and places like this, you will come to know how difficult it is like to survive uh, with Christianity. But yet there are people who are fighting it one day at a time, holding, holding on to the fort and holding on to the religion and making it, uh, making it the best in the world and telling the world that we belong to Christ, we will live for Christ, we will live for Christ. Lots of challenges in this place. Please pray for Punjab and the other states of India. Till we meet again. Goodbye and God bless you.